Hi. Hi. How are you? I'm tired. <gasps> Daylight savings is the worst. Seriously. Well, let's cheers. We're going to feel better after this. Watch. <laughs> No. No, I, no, I need to drink it. No, then I'll feel better. That's, that's the key. That's See, secret. that's what I haven't been doing. Dang it. No, and I was fine yesterday on Sunday. I was okay. This morning, though. Oh, the kids. Get them out of bed. Oh, just, it needs to go away. Yeah. There's That's certain enough. states that are like, but they're just done. I'm done. Uh, yeah, well, with, with, with my son. And then poor Brian, who just got back from Japan. So he was already 14 hours off. Now he's 13, 15. I don't know. He's I sleeping imagine. right now. Yeah. <laughs> Either way, you'll be seeing that's, Brian that's back soon, but for now, you get Drew and Rachel, and we're here to talk about something kind of timely, because something happened last week that happens every year, Lamy launched their limited all-star. Yes, this is the special edition bronze. Um, how would you, do, I mean, do you think they did a good job naming the color? In my mind, I expect bronze to be a little bit more brown? like that, but with a hint of brown, yeah. yeah. So it's not bad. It's not orange either. No, it it's, is in between. It is, it's almost there. The ink is orange. The ink is definitely orange. The ink is orange. pretty orange. I was expecting the ink to be a little more brown, but it's still a really nice color. It's kind of coppery. It is. Look, there's bronze and then here's old bronze. What? Statue of Liberty. Get it? Oh. No? Tina. Yeah. No, but like here's, here's a legit orange. So, right. you know. And this then here's a brown. So, I mean... That's definitely not bronze, and that's definitely not bronze. So if one of these pens was going to be called bronze, it would be that one. So I'm fine with it. So we we rated Brian's uh, pen collection here. Because so we we've have... never done that before. Flashback. <laughs> so we have the history of the All-Star Special Editions, and some of these came back as regular editions. We did, and we've, we've carried them right up until about kind of this point onward. We, yeah, this is about 20, uh, 20, early 2011 is when we picked up the line. Mm -hmm. So the coffee, I think it just ended at Well, MLB. when I started the company, the coffee was already there. So, like, I didn't know you it was a limited started... edition. It's, I started in 2011. Yeah, in May. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And it was still there, and I didn't know it was going to go away. When I found out it was going away, I had to buy one. It was like, I think it was the, the, from the previous year. And then yeah. this was like our first, like, yes. real launch. And I got, I, a dent, I got a dented one of those. I know. I, I don't even know how that happened. Anyway, um, so yes, there, should we? There's quite, yeah, we what, can go what, through what them. Do, what are we, what do are we want doing? To do it? Let's, let's start from the newest and go okay. back, because these are the ones more fresh in everybody's mind. We can actually compare it to the copper orange as well. Yes. So as you saw... The bronze is here now. If you get, if you like it, you can go get it. It has a corresponding ink available. Comes in extra fine, fine, and medium. You can do the interchangeable nibs and swap it out. Which is um, super cool. Which we actually do have stock of like the italics and broad and some other stuff right now. Mm -hmm. And also currently available no. is, is not, oh, we finally no, sold out of these? Out. Well, how about that? We have the, the ink. <laughs> we have matching we ink. Finally, these hung out for a while, though. Yeah, they did. Uh, so, uh, Vibrant Pink was last year's they special like edition. They like to take like two words and smush them together. It's not Vibrant Pink, it's Vibrant Pink. Oh, yeah, and bro... I say like copper orange and <laughs> charge green and... Vibrant Pink, <laughs> bronze, one, one bronze, word. Bronze, one word. Do they do it in all caps like Lamy? No, the V and the P are capitalized. Ah, the old camel case, as it were. <laughs> All right, I'm sorry. Pacific Blue. Pacific Blue. Two words. Word? Two, Two words. words. Oh, my God. So, this so is we actually, fun, lovely. funny, we actually have some of these in stock at the moment because we got a, like a random second chip. At first, okay, so first we thought it was coming back. <laughs> we were told it was coming back as a regular edition, and then we just got a small ship, and we're like, well, where's the rest? They're like, oh, it's just a one and done thing. We're like, okay. So if you missed out on Pacific Blue, we do actually have some. And the matching ink for this one was actually uh, Lummi Turquoise that they rebranded. It was exactly like Lummi Turquoise. It was Lummi Turquoise. <laughs> yes, it was So indeed. if you missed out on the ink, you can get Lummi Turquoise. Always. It just, just pretend that it's called Pacific Blue. Charge screen, not th this, uh, you know... It, it followed the Lamy Safari, like the neon lime, mm -hmm. the neon green. One might kinda... one might say there was a neon era at Lamy around this time. Well, this this color, that color range is very popular in Asia, and Lamy is really big in Asia, so they're kind of catering to, to that market a little bit. I will say, not the most memorable no. version of the All Star that I've seen. But it's most vibrant. I it, mean, it is, even though it's not called vibrant. It's so charged up, though. Yes. Charged green. 
And we can get to the copper orange now. Yes, which, this was a really popular one. And we can spend some time talking about this guy. 2014. Yeah, this is absolutely gorgeous. And I remember the ink absolutely exploded in popularity. Yes, that was the first time they did um, a special ink. Was it really? Yes. Well, that would explain it. We also didn't have enough. I remember that. Right. It took several years until the ink was plentiful enough. Yeah, but it had a beautiful ink, really good looking color. And if you look at the assortment, it really does kind of stand out. It's the only orange or in the family of orange. And I was we just can actually the uh, little the note cards with the goldfish on it. I remember it was done with that pen and ink. Those are cool goldfish. Mm -hmm. If you're lucky enough to get one of Whitney's uh, signed note cards with the goldfish, sometimes she draws little like top hats and stuff on the goldfish oh. themselves. It's pretty amazing. Um, so we can compare these guys. Yep. The, uh, we the can all, do you want to spend a minute to talk about the ink as well? Yes, the ink is very similar. Um, there is a very subtle difference. I've heard some people like this is more yellow, this is more red. And it really depends on your own See, eyes. See, I, I, I don't know. Other if I people, can, they're like, I can't tell the difference. I can't tell the difference. I don't think it's the same color, but I'm not. I don't know. You don't think it's a turquoise situation? I well, it's it's different than turquoise because turquoise is regularly available and rebranded simultaneously. This is kind of a bringing it back type thing, so it's a little. It feels kind of a bringing it back. It feels less awkward. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. But if you missed out on the copper orange ink, the I mean, bronze ink would be yeah, either a comparable way, substitute. Either way, it's a good looking ink. Yeah. It really is. And um, no, I think it, it's definitely worth a purchase for sure. Here's another twofer. Twofer. Blue-green. Blue ah, yes. Green-blue. Blue green. No, blue-green. Oh. <laughs> Potato-tomato. Blue-green. Um, and uh, this one was kind of the first uh, green pen in quite a, while, quite a while. You see this one here. I mean, that's a pretty big gap. They haven't had like a green-green. I'm, no. looking, I'm looking at the line, I'm like, no. okay, there's no, like, true purple. There's no, like, true green. These are all, like, shades off, you know? Yeah, and what I will say, though, with Which aluminum... It's different than the Safari. Safari's, like, crayon color. Yeah, for sure. One thing I will say about aluminum, though, is you do get colors that put on aluminum, the actual material, it just makes the color look really unique and individual. Hmm. That's one of the reasons the All-Stars are one of my favorites, is and why I gravitate to them more so than the Preppies. I'm sorry, than the Safaris. Oh, there's no nib on this one. <laughs> yeah, a couple of them are missing nibs. Um, is because they have these aluminum-only colors, is the best way I can think to describe it, that I just don't see represented elsewhere in the pen world. And That's I, true. I, I, don't, I don't see, like, a plastic one in that color. No, it, you can't. It's just it's dumped, something about the way aluminum shines and bounces light off, but it's also kind of matte as well. It's a really interesting thing to stare at for a long time. And I like the grip of the of the All-Star as well, the translucent smoky yeah, thing going on. I do too. Should I grab Safari just for comparison? Oh. I can closer. Um, before the blue green, the year before, there were two special editions that year. So there was the black and the pearl. The black came back later as a regular edition, which we currently have, which we're still looking. Um, and the pearl around. happened simultaneously. So that was the first time we ever had two at the same time, which is pretty cool. Is the first time? Is it the first time they've done that? Uh, I think so. This 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 one of Brian's is actually a rollerball. You can tell because there's no ink ah. window, and because there's a, I feel like it's like a pregnancy test. I shouldn't say the way you're drinking, like the minus sign and the plus sign. Yep. You know, um, so the plus sign indicates it's a fountain pen, and the minus indicates it's a rollerball, and you can also tell by the. Absence of an ink window. Did the do, do the All Stars ever just have the the, the dot? Circle? Yeah. Uh, like like the Safari sometimes do. I don't think they do. I don't know. I've never seen one with just the circle. I haven't seen one in a long time with just the circle. Hmm. So yeah, there's been several iterations. Brian has a video on that specifically, so go find it. <laughs> Sorry. Um. Honey. So move, moving right along, the uh, ruby. we mentioned the ruby. This one blows me away. I love this color. Yeah. This this is a really nice red. All right. We talked about the brown. Coffee. Coffee. Oh, God, I love this pen. Yeah. There aren't enough brown pens, in my opinion. Says Drew Brown. <laughs> I know, yeah. Sales might say otherwise. But uh, this, this... Originally called Black Purple, came back as a regular edition as just purple. Plain purple. Just, no, just purple. I'm, no, not just. just purple. I, I, I know. <laughs> purple. Yeah, I bought this one, too. I really like this one. I think that it's a really... Again, it's a unique it's like a plum. flavor of purple. Yeah. But it's like shiny plum. Black raspberry. Mm -hmm. But purple. Now, now we're getting into unknown territory for me. What the heck is this thing? Uh, it is raspberry, and this is before my time as well. Oh man! There was a time that Lummy didn't sell to us. <gasps> slash a time we didn't exist. Some of these came out like before we were around. <laughs> they kind of coincide. It took a while to land Lummy because we were this online-only retailer in our. I know. I I I did that. 
Um, <laughs> that was you. This is my racial impression. <laughs> Send out my emails. Um, we're in a garage, but come in, on. We're in a garage. It's we're, okay. We're online only. I know you've never done this before. <laughs> you can trust us. It's fine. We got like five people working we're in our garage. We're, we're totally up to the county codes. We weren't. That's why we moved. Um, mm -hmm. Too well, many people in that parking well, lot. To fairness, driveway. we were compliant to my knowledge of the law. As soon as I realized we were not compliant, we took care of it. You know, I that, did, I you did, know that wouldn't hold up, right? Did, well, that's why I said. was in compliance based on my own knowledge. <laughs> to, you, you, always sign, you always sign to the best of my abilities. It's fine because I had knowledge. no idea. <laughs> I didn't know. Nobody told me. Um, finishing, finishing, yeah, finishing things up, grabbed a safari to your point about how the uh, color is just kind of different based on the material. The, the safaris are more just flat. Yeah, like crayon colors, like you mentioned. But you get this really unique shimmer and sheen to, not shimmer, sheen, to the all-star colors. It's just the way aluminum looks with color I attached to it. show the, um, the difference in the grips. Oh too. yeah, for sure. <clears throat> yeah, so the Safari continues the same um, plastic resin, ABS, whatever it is. Um, uh, uh, <laughs> words. Yeah. It's early, daylight savings, um, versus the translucent. But same nib, same filling mechanism, the whole thing. So, um, in my opinion, do, do you think that the all-star is worth the extra I prefer the All-Star to yeah, the Safari. Yeah, me too. I think it's worth the extra money. It's just, it's classier, it feels nice. It's and like let's quickly great. finish off with these th yes. three things. What do we call green, Silver green, silver blue, silver blue, and um, graphite, which is a regular edition as well. So several of these are available. Well, this is temporarily available. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Now that's so, actually helpful. So if you do want to get any of these, you can still get some of these. Yeah, so these are, am I missing one? Right. Oh, blue green came hey, back as well. Hey, there you go. So this is the regular line. And t no. <laughs> I just want to hold up something, Rachel. You're holding up something. This is temporarily available, but probably not for much longer. And this we should have for the next year. So here's our current selection of all stars. Cool. Thank you thank for you. watching. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Drink and all the coffee to survive daylight savings Monday. <laughs> thank you and right on.